It's 10 trivia questions on the New England Patriots for Patreon subscriber Donald Fuller. This is Trivia with Buds. And welcome to another episode of the Trivia with Buds podcast. I'm your host, Ryan Buds. Thanks for checking out the show, and thanks for leaving iTunes reviews. If you're new to the show and you have not done that, we've got 385 of those. Would love to hit 400 very soon if you leave a review. Email ryanbuds at gmail.com so I can send you some free stuff in the mail. I'm talking magnets. I'm talking stickers. I'm talking bookmarks and more, plus free puzzles for my live trivia nights, little worksheets you can do at home if you love trivia. Today's episode all about the New England Patriots. If you love football, this round is for you. Before we get to that, we've got our Geek Out Challenge here, recording in my backyard on a beautiful springtime kind of day. You might hear some birds. Here's your first challenge. Name four films in which a stakeout appears. For television, two TV shows starring Saturday Night Live alumni. For books, two titles about a vacation gone awry. For music, four songs about sports. And for miscellaneous, four franchises that depict a false utopia. Some very tough ones there. I will see what I can do at the end of the episode trying to answer those geek out challenges. And let me know how you do on social media at Ryan Buds uh, on pretty much everything or Trivia with Buds on Facebook. I want to hear about your. Songs about sports. I think that could be a great future trivia round. All right, it's time to dive into some sports trivia with New England Patriots for Don Fuller. Here we go. All right, we've got New England Patriots trivia. Let's see what you know. Question number one, which NFL team did the New England Patriots defeat in their first Super Bowl win in 2001? Which NFL team did the Patriots defeat in 2001 for their first Super Bowl win? Number two, how many total touchdown passes does Tom Brady hold the record for? Number two, how many total touchdown passes does Tom Brady hold the record for? Number three, who is the all-time leading rusher in New England Patriots history? Who's the all-time leading rusher in New England Patriots history? Number four from 1997 and 1999, who was the Patriots head coach before Bill Belichick? Who was the Patriots head coach before Bill Belichick? Number five, who holds the record for the most receiving yards in a single season by a New England Patriots player? Number five, who holds the record for the most receiving yards in a single season by a New England Patriots player? Number six, who is the all-time leader in career sacks for the New England Patriots? Who is the all-time leader in career sacks for the Patriots? Number seven, what movie of 2023 starred Jane Fonda and Sally Field with a focus on the 2017 Super Bowl? What movie of 2023 starred Jane Fonda and Sally Field with a focus on the 2017 Super Bowl? Number eight, what was Rob Gronkowski's jersey number on the Patriots? Number eight, what was Rob Gronkowski's jersey number on the Patriots? Number nine, Deflate Gate started in January of what year? Deflate Gate started in January of what year? Number ten, in their inception in 1959, the New England Patriots were originally known as what team? In their inception in 59, the Patriots were originally known as what team? And number 11, Patriots. Bonus question for two points. Who is the first Patriot to be inducted into the NFL Hall of Fame back in 1991? Who is the first Patriot in the Hall of Fame in 91? Those are all your questions on New England Patriots trivia. If you want to pick a topic just like my friend Don Fuller, make sure you go to patreon.com slash trivia with buds and sign up for $5 a month or more in support of the show. I'll send you a link to a spreadsheet. You can fill in all your topics for the months through the end of the year. Five bucks a month. Do it up. We'll be right back with the answers after this. 
We are back with the answers to New England Patriots trivia. Let's see what you knew. Number one, which NFL team did the Patriots defeat for their first Super Bowl win back in 2001? It was the St. Louis Rams. St. Louis Rams. Number two, how many total touchdown passes does Tom Brady hold the record for? 649. 649. Number three, who is the all-time leading rusher in New England Patriots history? Sam Cunningham. Sam Cunningham. Number four, from 97 to 99, who is the Patriots head coach before Bill Belichick? Pete Carroll. Pete Carroll. Number five, who holds the record for the most receiving yards in a single season by a Patriots player? Wes Welker. Wes Welker. Number six, who is the all-time leader in career sacks for the Patriots? Andre Tippett. Andre Tippett. Number seven, what movie of 2023 starred Jane Fonda and Sally Field with a focus on the 2017 Super Bowl? 80 for Brady. 80 for Brady. Produced by Tom Brady. And number eight, what was Rob Gronkowski's jersey number on the Patriots? 87, my good friend Gronk. You can see a picture of me and Gronk on Facebook. Search Buds Gronk. You'll see it. Number nine, Deflate Gate started in January of what year? 2015. 2015. Number 10, in their inception, the Patriots in 1959 were known as the Boston Patriots. Boston Patriots. And number 11, who is the first Patriot to be inducted into the NFL Hall of Fame in 91? John Hanna. John Hanna. There you go, Don Fuller. Hope you had fun answering those questions. And as a super fan of the Patriots, if I got anything wrong, let me know. RyanBuds at gmail.com. We have a fact of the day for you. It's Dennis Rodman has 28 siblings. Whoa, that's a lot of offspring for Dennis Rodman's family. 28 siblings. Uh, we have the Geek Out Challenges for me. Four films in which a stakeout appears. Uh, isn't there a movie called Stakeout with uh, Emilio Estevez and Richard uh, somebody? <laughs> that's that's as good as I can get. A stakeout is a state. What is a stakeout? Where people are waiting outside of a building? Like all the Lethal Weapon movies have a stakeout, I would say. Um, Donnie Brasco, Reservoir Dogs. I think they do some staking out in Reservoir Dogs. I don't know. That's a bad question for me. Two shows starring Saturday Night Live alumni. I'm going to say uh, The Real Rob, which is a Rob Schneider sitcom kind of a thing. And I'm going to say um, 30 Rock, Tina Fey. Two titles about a vacation gone awry for books. Oh, Die Every Wimpy Kid, The Long Haul. Annabelle just read that. And it's about their vacation going crazy. And that's all I got there. Four songs about sports. Uh, How I Beat Mike. How I... Something Aaron Carter faces... No, Lil Bow Wow? Somebody faces Michael Jordan in basketball and they beat them. Some child. That would never happen. Uh, I think it's Aaron Carter. How I Beat Mike, I think is the name of that song. And that may be all I've got for songs about sports. I can't think of songs that the lyrics are about playing sports like you know we are the champions but that's not really about a sport that's a very tough one and four franchises that depict a false utopia elysium with matt damon that was about a utopian society and that's all i got there man i think i got one for all those except the snl one so hopefully you did better than me thanks for listening Thanks for telling a friend. Thanks for leaving iTunes reviews and email ryanbuds at gmail.com when you do so with your mailing address so I can send you free stuff. And we'll see you next time. For more trivia with Buds, cheers.